Since January 26, 2023, our system ranks Microsoft as a hold slash accumulate, giving it a score of 0 0.464. During this period the stock has outperformed our expectations with an gain 8.6% since we first told you to buy Microsoft 15 days ago. This is an average return of 0.57% per day since first recommended. In our daily updates for Microsoft our last headline reads, weaker technical forecast for Microsoft as stock downgraded to hold slash accumulate. The Microsoft stock price fell by minus 1.05% on the last day, Wednesday, February 15, 2023, from $272.17 to $269.32. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 1.71% from a day low at $266.18 to a day high of $270.73. The price has fallen in 6 of the last 10 days but is still up by 6.56% over the past 2 weeks. Volume fell on the last day along with the stock, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the stock. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 9 million shares and in total, 28 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $7.64 billion. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $315.95, and the lowest price was $213.43. Right now the price is 14.76%, or $46.63, below 52-week high and 22.98%, or $80.35 below all-time high November 22, 2021. The stock rise in the upper part of the line week rise in trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good selling opportunity for the short-term trader as reaction back towards the lower part of the trend can be expected. A breakup at the top trend line at $272.38 will firstly indicate a stronger rate of rising. The current three-month trend indicates a possible 4.97% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 11.05% and 6.16%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 17.38% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 39.19% and minus 16.58%. This equals a price between $163.77 and $224.66 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Wednesday, February 8, 2023 Piper Sandler set price target to 290. On Wednesday, February 8, 2023 Wedbush set price target to 280. On Wednesday, February 8, 2023 Oppenheimer set price target to 280. On Wednesday, February 8, 2023 Jeffrey set price target to 310. On Wednesday, February 8, 2023 Mizuho set price target to 300. From analysts Microsoft stock received a general strong buy rating. The analysts give PE ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been found for Microsoft. The Microsoft stock holds by signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a positive forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general buy signal from the relation between the two signals where the short-term average is above the long-term average. On corrections down, there will be some support from the lines at $267.69 and $245.84. A breakdown below any of these levels will issue sell signals. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence (MACD). Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Tuesday, February 14, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 1.05%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal. Pivots, sell signal 2 days ago. Bollinger, buy signal 6 days ago. Short-term moving average, sell signal 14 days ago. 
long-term moving average, by signal 19 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 16 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 21 days ago. The long-term moving average, sell signal 17 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 14 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk and Stop Loss for Microsoft Microsoft finds support from accumulated volume at $266.73 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $4.55 between high and low, or 1.71%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 2.44%. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for Microsoft. The price-to-earnings ratio, P-E ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per-share earnings. Microsoft currently has a price-earning ratio of 27.57. This is a relatively normal price-to-earnings ratio and often seen in business with long track record or predictable revenues. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, Microsoft meets first resistance at $271.32. If you do not hold Microsoft shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. On a downturn Microsoft finds first level of support at $266.73 and this is a natural place to put your bet if the support holds with an expectation of a rebounce upwards. The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for Microsoft is strong buy. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On February 13, 2023 Capicella Christopher C. made an inside sell of 1,000 of common stock. On February 9, 2023 Capicella Christopher C. made an inside sell of 1,000 of common stock. On January 31, 2023 Walmsley Emma N. made an inside sell of 711 of common stock. On January 31, 2023 Walmsley Emma N. made an inside buy of 237 of common stock. On January 31, 2023 Warrior Pudmushri made an inside buy of 63,052 of restricted stock units. Based on the 100 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be positive at a ratio of 18.663. In total, the insiders bought 54,063,878 and sold 366,821,966 shares in the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss is $258.39, minus 4.06%. This stock has medium daily movements and this gives medium risk. There is a sell signal from a pivot top found one days ago. Is Microsoft stock a buy? Microsoft holds several positive signals, but we still don't find these to be enough for a buy candidate. At the current level, it should be considered as a hold candidate, hold or accumulate, in this position whilst awaiting further development. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a buy to a hold slash accumulate candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is overvalued. For the trading on Thursday 16th we expect Microsoft to open down $0.577 and start trading at $268.74. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to